Sooner Scoop HD. Everybody in general, man, it's just I cannot have no, no complaints at all. Getting the you know getting immersed in the Jerry Schmidt workout regime is uh, everybody always talks about it. What what have you learned about that, or what did you not know about it? Man, I didn't know it was gonna. I mean, I knew it was gonna be hard, but man, it's hard. But uh, man, it's it's making us better, you know. Every a lot of things he likes to use is strain every every rep, strain every set, and and, and uh, man. He doesn't. He doesn't joke around when he says that. Like, I mean, you need to. But, but at the end of the day, we're getting better. We're just. We're getting stronger. We're getting faster. It's just all the above, man. If you know what you're working for, you love to do it. It's very, you know, it's fairly common what you what you're doing now. The early entry coming in at January, 15 years ago, not all that common. What What have you found to be the pros and cons of your decision to do that? Uh, man, the 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 staff that I have here working with me, uh, they've done an amazing job of just helping me and, and, and keeping me going. And, and, and on those hard days, you know, uh, helping me get through those hard days and, and, and helping me get through the easy days. And, and, and just there's, I can't say there's really been. I mean, the pros are, uh, they keep going on and on. The cons is just, man, the, the days that you've got to walk to class, man. You got those long walks, and, and other than that, but I mean, this everybody here, man, they do a good job of just making you feel like you belong, and, and injury or not, they just do a great job at that. So I can, I don't really have any cons. Is do you feel like you're missing anything? Not finishing out your last four years at McAllister? Uh, man, I'm. I mean, four months. I'm sorry, four months. Uh, uh, I, I'm definitely, uh, it's definitely a few, the first few weeks was like, man, you know, I'm in college and I didn't even, you know, all my friends are back in high school, you know, having fun and all that. Uh, but at the end of the day, what I'm, what I'm going to do and what I'm trying to do is bigger than that. Uh, I, uh, I needed to move on and just, and get better and find ways to get, to get ahead of the game, especially now that I'm a little set back. So, so, um. I, I think that it's been it's been a great thing. I've I've been happy, more than happy that I made this decision to do this. How do you feel when you say the setback? How how much have you been set back by the by the injury? Uh, when it comes to when it comes to footwork and stuff like that, working with these DBs and learning how the speed works, uh, that's the setback I would say. But uh, other than that, like just working out the upper body and stuff like that, getting bigger, gaining weight. Uh, I, I, that's been that's been a, that's been a big help for me uh, being able to still work out the upper body. I still get to work out my right leg. I mean, you know, I still do everything I possibly can. But just the running and stuff like that, not being able to work DB drills with these guys, has been a little bit harder on me. But I've never had an injury like this, so this is still me getting used to it, and, and I just got to be patient. What's the prognosis yeah. in terms of when you'll be close to full strength? Uh, they, I'm hoping by July. Uh, the, the, the set month is August, but I'm hoping I can come back a little bit early. Uh, I've been, PT's been going great. Um, I'm in the process where you can't rush anything, but I'm doing everything at the best, best of my ability, and I'm getting things done that I need to have done. So I'm hoping that whenever I finally get out of this process, I can start speeding things up a little bit more, but still be 100%. Is it comforting? If I was in this situation, I would sort of find some relief in knowing I'm surrounded by professionals that know what they're doing. Uh, yeah. And all, all they have to do is tell me what to do, and if I do it, I'll be okay. Is, yeah. that, is that sort of your mindset? <laughs> oh yeah, it, that, that's a huge thing, you know. Uh, with getting up here early, that was a big thing for me. Is um, just just being with a staff that knows what they're doing, and, 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 and this is their job. This is what they do for a living, and, and just helping guys that have injuries like me and. Especially this staff, man. I've grown close to this staff, and, and, and so that's also been a big thing. And just, just the whole process. Like I said, you know, some days you got those hard days, and these guys help you get through those hard days and help pick up you, pick you up when you're having those hard days. And not only that, but they they, they push you to get better every single day. Had you already made the decision to come in early when you got hurt? Uh, yes, I, you, I So had. that was already made. That was already made. Um, I had already made that decision. So when I got hurt. Uh, I just had to look at it as well. Uh, at least I'm getting getting up there early. Getting uh, I, I I wasn't. I'm not lucky that I made the made that decision because you know doing this injury is not lucky at all. But it just it, it worked out great. I guess you could say. Sooner scoop HD.